Hey there, join us on our channel as we embark on a journey through time to explore the captivating evolution of one of the most beloved TV shows of all time, Hawaii 5 0. Jack Lord in 1968, age 48, played the role as Detective Steve Medarit. Jack in 1998, 77 years, died of congestive heart failure. Lord's character was known for his tough demeanor and no-nonsense approach to fighting crime, and he was often seen leading his team in solving complex cases involving murder, espionage, and other criminal activities. James Mark Otter in 1968, age 31, played the role as Danny Williams. James in 2010, 72 years, died of unknown causes. Dano was one of the members of Steve McGarry's elite team of police detectives, and he was known for his quick wit and occasional hot-headedness. Throughout the show's 12-year run, MacArthur's character was a constant presence and served as McGarry's second-in-command, often helping him to solve complex cases and bringing a bit of levity to the otherwise serious proceedings. Cam Fong in 1968, age 50, played the role as Chin Hao. Cam in 2002, 84 years, died of lung cancer. Detective Kelly was known for his quiet, calm demeanor and his strong sense of justice. Cam Fong's portrayal of the character was widely acclaimed and helped make Hawaii 5 one of the most popular and iconic television shows of his time. Harmon Wedemeyer in 1968, age 44, played the role as Detective Duke Lekela. Harmon in 1999, 74 years, died of heart attack. Sergeant Lukella was a recurring character who worked as a liaison between the police and the Hawaiian community. He was known for his integrity, dedication, and deep knowledge of the local culture and customs. Wedemeyer's performance as Duke Lukella was widely praised for his authenticity and for bringing a unique perspective to the show. Harry Endo in 1969, age 47, played the role as Chief Fong. Harry in 2009, 86 years, died of stroke. Chief Fong was a recurring character who worked closely with the 5-0 team, analyzing evidence and providing scientific expertise to help solve cases. Endo's performance as Chief Fong was highly regarded, and he became a beloved character on the show. In addition to his work on Hawaii 5 Endo was a prolific character actor who appeared in numerous television shows and films throughout his career. Richard Denning in 1968, age 54, played the role as the governor. Richard in 1998, 84 years, died of heart attack. Governor Jameson was a recurring character who was the head of the state government in Hawaii and often called upon the 5-0 team to handle sensitive and high-profile cases. Then his performance as Governor Jameson was praised for his authoritative and statesmanlike demeanor. Al Harrington in 2021, 85 years, died of stroke. Al Harrington in 2021, 85 years, died of stroke. Detective Kokyo was a recurring character who worked closely with the 5-0 team, assisting in investigations and providing a unique perspective as a native Hawaiian. Harrington's performance as Detective Kokyo was highly regarded, and he became a fan favorite on the show. Danny Kenkona in 1968, age 33, played the role as Nick. Age in 1996, 60 years, cause of death unknown. Nick was a recurring character who was often called upon by the 5-0 team to provide information or assistance in their investigations. King Kona's performance as Fats was highly regarded, and he brought a unique charm and humor to the character. King Kona was a prolific character actor who appeared in many films and television shows throughout his career, and he was also a respected musician and teacher. Glenn Cannon in 1970, age 38, played the role as Manicult. Glenn in 2013, 81 years, died of unknown causes. Doug Bugman was a recurring character who worked as the chief medical examiner in Hawaii and often assisted the 5-0 team in their investigations by providing forensic analysis and medical expertise. Tanner's performance as Doug Bugman was highly praised, and he became a beloved character on the show. Peggy Ryan in 1968, age 44, played the role as Jenny. Peggy in 2004, 80 years, died of stroke. Ryan played a recurring role as Secretary Jenny Sherman in Hawaii 5-0. Bill Edwards in 1971, age 53, played the role as Jonathan Kay. Bill in 1999, 81 years, died from natural causes. He appeared in season 11, episode 22, titled War to War Fat, which aired on April 5, 1979. In the episode, he played the character of Captain Ed Marsden. Edwards also appeared in several other television shows and movies during his career. Seth Sakai in 1971, age 39, played the role as Battle. Set in 2007, 75 years, died from non-communicable disease. Chief Fong was responsible for analyzing evidence and assisting the 5-0 team with their investigations. Sakai's portrayal of Chief Fong became a fan favorite, and he reprised the role in the 1997 made-for-television movie McBride, The Chameleon Mother, and in the rebooted Hawaii 5 series in 2011. William Smith in 1979, age 46, played the role as Detective James Kimo Kale. William in 2021, 88 years, died of unknown causes. 
He played different characters in each appearance, including the characters of Sergeant Bochum, Harry K. Brown, and Frank Vashon. Smith is a veteran actor who has appeared in numerous television shows and movies, including Ledo, Rich Man, Poor Man, and Any Which Way You Can. He is also known for his work as a stuntman and martial artist, having trained in various martial arts such as judo and karate. Al Eben in 1968, age 53, played the role as Dr. Birdman. Al Eben in 2003, 88 years died of unknown causes. He played different characters in each appearance, including the characters of Joe Gannon, Mr. Buck, and Harry Ravello. Eben was a character actor who appeared in numerous television shows and movies throughout his career, including Gunsmoke, The Twilight Zone, and Perry Mason. He was also a veteran of World War II, having served in the United States Army.